Can I do that to a photo? This lovely sexy photo of me. Hey guys and welcome to this week's video. So I've just got back from Berlin. Uh, had a really good time, although we've had a few issues again with the flights. But we're now back in the UK and I'm going to be back for a while now, I think. I've still not gone through a haul from when I came back from Malaga. So today that's what I thought I'd do. And I've got some things that I'm going to show you now. Some of them I wanted to buy, some of them I didn't want to buy. I'll explain that in a minute. And some things I just think are a bit weird. But let's uh, share them. So first of all, I got myself this, which is an England flag. Did I want an England flag? No. What happened was I was in Gibraltar and I wanted a flag of Gibraltar. So I asked the woman to get me one in the shop and she did, or to her knowledge anyway, so I paid £10 for an England flag, which I did not want. You'll be glad to know, however, I had a delivery today. And this is what I had inside. My new flag of Gibraltar. I also purchased this Gibraltar photo of me in like some magnet form thing that goes on a stand. That was six euros, but I got it especially because for some reason I seem to look like a rocker. I also brought myself this nice t-shirt from H&M, which I got in Malaga. The reason I'm not showing it now anyway is because it is now in the wash because I've just worn it in Berlin, so never mind, eh? And also, because it's so hot, I got a few of my friends some Spanish fan things and they also make this clicking sound which I'm addicted to. I probably should have got myself one of these but I don't think it's my style really. I know that the next two things are not really things that I brought out there but the things that I collected when I was out there. One of them is this which is a £10 note but it's the Government of Gibraltar and that's going to go with my Probably foreign currency, because I'm not going to be able to spend this in this country. I can go and change it at the bank, but I can't spend it. I also have managed to keep my rail tickets. These are Renfe Vieros uh, Avant rail tickets for Cordoba, for the Ave, or the Avant, as we ended up on. And I also have my Serantias tickets for the local trains, including my rail pass for the week, which is none of those three. So that's it for what I actually brought back from Spain. I didn't really bring back much because I've had to save my euros for Berlin. Another video like this will be up for Berlin. And if you haven't checked out my Berlin videos yet, which probably won't be up here yet, or my Malaga videos, make sure you, you click on the Berlin one there and the Malaga one there, which will show you everything that I brought when I was out there. Hope you've enjoyed this week's video. If you have, make sure you give me a like down below. You can also subscribe on my channel by clicking on there. And when you click on that, that will take you straight to the subscription. Press subscribe and you get to see more and more videos like this. I also have my Twitter above my subscribe area as well as my Snapchat, and I post on Twitter and Snapchat very regularly, especially when I'm doing some travelling. So if you want to get to see what I do in my life, because I haven't done a day in the life yet, you can uh, go on there and follow me on Twitter and Snapchat. Thanks for watching this week's video. Make sure you give it a like below and a comment, and I'll see you next week. Bye!